Okay, this is uh, part of disassembling an engine that uh, we had a valve train failure on. Uh, as you can see, the uh, three lifters sitting there have been kicked out of the bores. Uh, the lifters look perfect. There is no sign of any damage to them. They look like they came out of the box. Perfect break in. So the problem wasn't the lifters. All pressure loss was caused by the lifters being kicked completely out of the bore. When I found these, they were laying in the middle, nowhere near the bore they came out of. So they came out of with quite a bit of force and velocity. Uh, the camshaft lift is not very high. Uh, it's sub 500. So it had to take a, quite a bit of uh, RPM to launch them across, uh, bounce off the valley tray, and uh, end up nowhere near the bores. Um, we have several damaged, I count, Seven of the eight uh, exhaust valve train assemblies are damaged. Uh, valves are seized in place. Probably every valve that kicked or has a bent push rod is seized in place and will not return. That one is moving perfectly fine. Uh, this one didn't kick yet, so actually eight of the eight exhaust. Now, this is a split pattern camshaft. Exhaust valves lift higher and stay open longer. Yes, every exhaust valve is seized. Somehow or other, a couple of the uh, push rods should not bend. So all the exhaust valves have seized, um, probably bent at the bottom end. I'll do another video once I get the heads up. Uh, this appears to be high RPM skied. Um, no damage to no signs of oil starvation yet. No heat damage. Uh, cam so far looks perfect. I'll take a uh, look again later and do another video.